to my normal background. That's because I'm taking you guys around with me to run some errands as I prepare to launch my business. Let me turn my air conditioner down because I feel like it's loud. So, uh, let's see, where to begin? So, clearly I'm driving. I'm on my way to um, get a post office box. Um, because currently right now on my invoices and everything the way everything is set up it has my personal home address and you know we don't want that because we ain't trying to have nobody popping up at my house just want to protect my privacy privacy um so i'm on my way to get a post office box um i should have a package for the rest of my inventory so i'm expecting the last of my inventory to arrive today um i have all my mink lashes Y'all, the popos is pulling up over here. And I definitely can't have them see me recording while I'm driving because your girl is not trying to get a ticket. <laughs> okay, but anyway, they gone. So, um, as far as my inventory is concerned, I have all of my mink lashes. So, today I'm expecting the rest of my faux mink lashes to arrive and some packaging. So, my packaging for my faux mink lashes and my mink lashes will be different. Um, my goal is to keep the prices very affordable. So in order to do that, um, my foaming packaging for my lashes will not be the same hard plastic case. It still will, will be good quality packaging, but um, it won't be the same as my mink lashes. Hopefully that makes sense. Um, so yeah, the foaming lashes will be considerably more affordable. And I want to do it that way because you know, a big part of my brand is, you know, making luxury products and luxury things accessible to all, um, you know, women and men who want it. You know, we're not selling $30 lashes. We're not selling $20 lashes, sis. Like, you know, lip gloss is not about to be $25 and $18. We want to make sure that all of our beauties can have access to great quality products, um, at an affordable price and so you know for the moms out there you know who always make sacrifices to get what their kids need and always put themselves last we, we want you to be able to have your minks boo we want you to be able to have your minks and buy your diapers too okay so uh yeah anywho and then i want to go by dollar tree um to get some tissue paper and just some other like little knickknacks you know to uh, finalize uh, my packaging for shipping and what else do I want to get um, I have a breakout on my face like these like small little bumps and then I got a pimple right here I don't know what's going on with my skin so I'm gonna make a run to Walgreens to get my holy grail skincare product which is uh, the essential oil tea tree oil not the oil you get from the beauty supply store but the essential oil that that stuff that smell like grass yeah i put that directly on my face with a carbon bar and it clears up my skin like that so i'm gonna go pick up some of that i need to get my nephew a birthday present and yeah so y'all we just running around and i'm taking y'all with me let me know if you like this format of my entrepreneur vlogs and you know this particular journey if so i'll do more videos like this with you guys just 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 let me know what you think so girl let me get off this camera because as you can see it's a lot going on through these windows child it's a lot 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 and we ain't trying to get into no wreck okay so i'll check in with y'all when i get to the place I forgot to tell y'all that these uh, eyeglasses are from my YouTube sis, Alicia Motley. Um, that's her YouTube channel and her um, website is shop919 frames. Her um, Instagram is 919 frames. I'm going to put all of her information in the description box below as well as the name of these style of shades. If you like, if you think they cute, girl, go pick up you a pair. Support, support, support. So I just got here. This place is called Postal Shipping and Printing. Uh, first class postal ship. I'm sorry. I'm all in my throat. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, it's called Postal Shipping and Printing or First Class Postal Shipping and Printing. So I decided not to go with a what do you call it? Uh with with, with renting a, a P.O. box directly from the post office because um sometimes packages can be delivered to P.O. box 
um, addresses they actually need physical locations and with this place they provide the PO box or mailbox rental service but it's a physical address so they receive packages from all carriers so FedEx DHL UPS etc etc and with me I'm always you know ordering inventory I may alternate between having some packages dropped off at my home address some packages dropped off at my post office box but I just like to have I like the idea of having the um, accessibility um, and the option um, to have packages delivered here instead of my home if I choose to so I'm about to go inside see what the prices are see if I can get it all set up and then I'll give y'all an update all right guys i am now the proud owner of a post office box <laughs> yeah i mean i know this may not seem like a big deal you know a post office box but to me it is i don't know why i feel emotional i don't know i guess because i just have big plans you know and y'all i'm just I want to break generational curses in my family and I've always wanted to be an entrepreneur and even though I've worked as a freelance makeup artist for a long time and I did it for you know I did it for a few years and I was successful in it made good money or whatever I just never took it to the level of seriousness that I'm doing now with this beauty boutique with the a-team initiative and then y'all i ain't gonna even tell y'all i already have another business in the works y'all look at my face i am seriously breaking out like what what is happening here i don't know what the i think it's maybe the uh moisturizer that i'm using i'm having an allergic reaction to this moisturizer but this is not cute girl we got to get some tea tree oil to fix this public vlogger just I don't like people staring at me so if I'm acting a little weird while I'm in here talking it's because people looking at me okay so let's see okay so I'm definitely gonna get different colors I'm gonna get two of these y'all it is so freaking hot here in Houston let me see, see let me see excuse okay no okay I was trying to see if I could sit y'all down and get a good angle so that um, I can do kind of like a car haul with y'all, show y'all what I got from Dollar Tree. Because I know once I get home, my baby probably gonna be up and she's gonna be doing her Avery things and she's not gonna let me do anything. So uh, I'm just gonna hold y'all in my hands and I'm gonna show y'all what I got. It's I, I didn't get that much stuff in Dollar Tree. Um, I didn't see all the things that I was looking for. Like I was trying to find some planner stickers and then I was trying to find some stickers, like thank you stickers that I can use on my packaging uh, for when I uh, pack up stuff to ship. I was also looking for some mailing label, well, not mailing labels, but um, 
fragile package labels to put on my actual packages when I ship them out. I'm probably going to have to just order them offline. But y'all know how the U, uh, U.S. Postal Service is. They just handle your package any kind of way. They so doggone reckless. Um, and so I just wanted to get some stickers to put on the packages that say fragile handle with care so that when they get packages for my customers that they would, you know, hopefully take good care of them. Um, so let me just go ahead and show y'all what I got real quick. Some of this I kind of gave y'all a sneak peek in the in the vlog. So I got, let's see if I can pull it out of the bag. I got two packs of tissue paper. So this is 35 pieces. So that's 70 total sheets of um, paper um, for $2. 70 pieces of tissue paper for $2. Look, y'all don't gotta spend a lot of money um, on your business to, you know, to make it happen. Dang it, I picked up the wrong ones. It's all right, I'm not going back. So I got these two things. Um, I actually got one. They're just kind of like uh, expandable file folders. And I actually meant to get this one in purple and then the same one in black. So I picked up two because um, if you don't know, if you haven't, if you don't follow my family vlog channel, which you should, my husband and I run a another business. It's a nonprofit community outreach um, program for young people, for, for youth, for teenagers. Um, and so I wanted to find a, a better way to keep track. Y'all, my hands are ashy. Excuse my ashy hands. But I want to find a better way to um, compile and keep track of our receipts so that when tax time comes, it's not hard for us to, you know, go over our expenses for the year. So I got one for my business and one for the A-Team initiative so that we can um, do a better job at tracking our receipts. So I got that. Um, I got a pack of six thank you cards. Now, for my my customers that make purchases, I already have pre-made um, cards that are going to go inside of your sales um, that are going to have a promo code on it and they're thanking you. Um, so I already have those and I'll show you guys that stuff when I get home. Um, but I got these specifically for when I send out uh, PR packages so that I can write a hand, um, a handwritten note to them just thanking them for agreeing to review and or promote my products. And so um, they won't get those cards because they didn't make a purchase, you know, so they're getting products for free. So I don't feel like I should give them their promo code to get a um, person out. Plus they're going to get their own promo code. So clearly they can use their own promo code to make purchases in the future if they want to. So these are just going to be for, not for my customers, but these are going to be for um, those beauty ambassadors or brand ambassadors and those who get PR packages for me just as a thank you. And as you can see, I only got six, so I'm not expecting to send out a whole lot of PR, just a couple. Um, what else? Oh, I got two bags of this. This is a decorative shred paper. When I was looking for this stuff on Amazon, it wasn't expensive, but it was too expensive for my liking. I do not plan on using a lot of this, just a little bit, just to give a little razzle dazzle. Um, so I got some of this to put inside of the packaging for when I ship inside of the little mesh bags, just to make it a little bit, you know, just to cutesy it up. And I think that's all I got. And I got some other random stuff, like two other random things. So I got my husband a, um, I got him a puzzle made, a personalized puzzle of him and my daughter for Father's Day last year. And he has started putting the puzzle together. It's gonna go on our gallery wall in our house. So I got him some Mod Podge uh, so that you can seal, pretty much seal the uh, puzzle after he's done putting it together so that it won't come apart. Um, so I got some of this, this was only a dollar. And then I got a frame for him to put it in so that we can put it on our gallery wall after it's done. So that's all I picked up from the Dollar Tree. I showed you guys my tea tree oil that I'm gonna use on my face. Um, I got that out of Walgreens. So y'all, let's go make one more um, stop to go pick up my uh, package from the mailbox. And uh, I wanna show you guys some, other, my, some of my other business supplies that I got some like business essentials that I have to start. Um, and yeah. That's it. So let's go ahead and go and wrap this thing up because it's hot. Okay, let's go. All right, guys, I am home. 
and it has been several hours later since I have made it home from running all those errands since y'all last saw me. I have cooked. I have cleaned up my kitchen. Well, I'm still cooking, waiting on my chicken to finish baking, but all the sides are done. I have cleaned up my kitchen, and I'm upstairs in my beauty room slash office that if you watch my last entrepreneur vlog, you know it's a work in progress. We're still working to get this organized, so don't come for me. But... All of my inventory did officially come, so my, my final package that I've been waiting for did come today. And I'm not going to show you guys my faux mink lashes on the vlog because I want it to be a surprise. Um, I'm waiting on my inventory for my synthetic lashes to come, but they'll be here by the time the store launches. And then I already have a small inventory of those synthetic lashes to start with. So, not tripping over those. So, I just want to show you guys some of my... Um, business essentials that i have um and i'm also going to show you guys the casing for my faux mink lashes so you guys have already seen my packaging for my mink lashes and just in case you have not let me show you real quick so it's this hard case okay oh crap we don't want to do that we don't we, we ain't got time to be breaking cases and getting lashes dirty nonsense that's money okay so like i said earlier in the vlog i want to keep my prices affordable so the prices for my folding or the packaging for my faux mink lashes is a variation of the packaging that i'm using for my mink lashes it's still going to be cute still going to be nice and sturdy and stable but it's not going to be as expensive because again the faux mink lashes um are not the same price point as the mink lashes so let me just show you guys an example of the packaging so it's simple plastic packaging so here is the package itself it does come with a tray insert and the little colorful insert so let me let me put one together real quick and i'll show you guys what it looks like okay so this is what it looks like very simple i will put the i'm gonna put my branding sticker inside of the tray so let me open it okay so here it is it open i think i'm going to actually glue using a hot glue gun and glue this down so that it doesn't slide around but the colorful insert is in there then you have the lash tray this is where i'm going to put my sticker and then it closes like this it's nice and sturdy also and then on the back this is where i'm going to put the name of the lashes so that's where the label will be and i'm going to put the name of the lashes on the back of my um my mink lash packages as well so let me show you some other stuff that i have over here i've been getting buku packages from amazon because i do have amazon prime if you are a business owner or planning on opening a business i highly recommend that you get amazon prime so here is all uh, the craziness okay so first and foremost i have some tape okay i did not order this offline this is another one of those uh random purchases i did on a run to the store to get some other stuff so you need tape um i have i have these right here these organza i'm sorry it's probably loud so i have these organza bags right here these are eight by tens if i'm not mistaken and these are five by sevens two different sizes okay this is a 50 pack and this is a 100 pack everything that i got off of amazon i will leave you guys links to it in the description box below just in case you're looking for these items for your own businesses these are very affordable i can't remember the prices i'll try my best to insert the prices for each on the screen of the video if not of course like i said there'll be links to everything in the description box below and then right here, which I have not even opened yet, this is my shipping scale. It's by the brand um, Accutech. This was very affordable. I think it was like $12. It has a 10 year warranty on it. So if this bad boy break, I can send it back. I'm gonna do a separate um, video on me setting up my store as far as like weighing my items and putting the weights for shipping and all the other stuff. So if you wanna see that, please make sure you subscribe um, and turn on your notifications so that when I do do that video, which I'll probably record that video tomorrow since I am getting ready for my launch. So that's that. Y'all, I'm sorry if this video is going to be long. Okay. So then 
Here are my bubble mailers. I only got one size. I need to get, I would like to actually get a smaller size. So like maybe like some four by sixes, but these are six by nine. These are gold and I think it's 50 in here if I'm not mistaken. Then coming back over here, I have my shipping labels. And I ordered some, what are these? Oh, you can't really tell through the packaging, but these are, I think one inch, one and a half inch. Let me turn this around. These are one and a half inch round. The labels is 750 in the pack. I will be using these to label my lashes. I'll do a video to show you guys how I make these or how I, how I set up my um, template to label my lashes. Um, most people, if you watch their videos, they use a label maker, but I didn't want to do a label maker. I felt like this would be easier. Okay, and then over here, these are some of my branding items. So this right here, these are, I was telling you guys about these. Let me cover the code. Hold on, y'all. So here we go. Yeah. So here are my thank you cards that are going to go inside of my purchases. And as you can see, for each one of you beauties that make a purchase, you'll get 10% off of your next purchase with the promo code that'll be included in here. Um, so here are my thank you cards that are gonna go inside of my bags or my uh, shipments. I got these off of Vista Print. And my business cards are right here. Again, I made these exclusively on Vista Print. So here are my business cards and y'all excuse my hands. My hands are ashy, they're dry because I have eczema and I've been cooking and cleaning. So my hands are really, really dry. So let me show you guys one up close. So here is my business card. So these will go into my packaging as well. I just put these to the side. What else do I need to show y'all? Um, oh. And last but not least, here are some stickers that I ordered from Vistaprint also that are going to go on my bargain lash bundles. I haven't created a name for them yet, but this is going to be a part of branding for some of my lashes that I'm selling. Okay, I also got a few other things that I wanted to show y'all. Just some random stuff that I picked up that I wanted to possibly use. So I showed you guys those stickers that I got made on Vistaprint. Um, that I will that I'm thinking about using on some of my lashes, but um, I also got these just in case. So these are shaped like address level uh, levels, <laughs> address labels from the Avery brand, but these are glossy clear. So these are transparent labels. So I got these just so that I can have them as an option to use, just in case I wanted to. You want to make sure you get printer paper. You're going to need printer paper to print out your um, packing slips. Um, so I just got a pack of printer paper as well. And I got these two from Target. And um, I'm just walking around making sure I showed you guys everything. And I think that is everything. So I'm going to be working on my like organizing this room and getting everything together. I'm actually about to go downstairs and get on Amazon and see if I can find a desk um, because ain't nobody got time to go look for one. I don't feel like it. I, I don't want to go look for a desk and I don't want to have to pack it into the car. Y'all, it's too hot for all of this. So I'm just going to let Amazon do the job for me. So yeah, I think I've showed you all of my essentials, all the things that you need to start. If you guys have any questions about anything, that I've shown you in this video, or if you would like for me to go into more depth about anything that I'm doing in this video, please let me know. I definitely don't mind answering your questions, don't mind helping you guys out. And uh, I think that's it. I think that's all I got for y'all today. So again, let me know if you like this style of video. It's very laid back, very vloggish, okay? And um, if so, then I'll keep bringing you guys content like this on my channel. And yeah, leave all your comments, questions below. And I'll promise I will get back to them as soon as possible. You hear my husband and my baby down there, they playing. So yeah, that's it. I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog right here so that I can finish cooking and edit and get to work. Y'all, I'm so excited. But before I go, 
I gotta remember to tell you that you are perfectly imperfect. Love all of you because God does and so do I. I'll see you guys in my next video and until then, y'all be blessed. Bye.